Jason. Welcome back. We're the Bourbon Junkies. He's Dan, I'm Sean. Tonight, we got a little throwback action. <laughs> this is one of our first reviews we've ever done. So we're gonna re-review it. We are. And then watch our first review of this. And probably just make fun of ourselves the whole time. Oh, for sure that's happening. It is Taylor's small batch. Literal classic, no, one of our favorites. Love it. Sean and I were going through old reviews of ours thinking, Sean had this idea. Let's like see, what, let's re-review one of our old reviews. And I'm like, dude, then we would know how much we've grown. My gosh, there's a freak, there's something in my eye. We've grown not at all, Finger. apparently. Fingers um, in your eye. And then I was like, dude, then we could see how much better we are at this, like pulling notes out and stuff and blah, okay, blah, blah. Right. And then it was like, well, then we could, we'll watch our own review after we review it. Short, we're gonna do a we short review. We haven't watched it yet. We haven't. We did see where it was in the, the it, I mean, it's in the corner of the office. It was in the corner of the office, right in front of the electrical box, if you're wondering. It's Taylor Somebody's Small Batch. complain, we're reviewing Buffalo Trace. Oh, mm, oh that's my good. gosh. Okay. Every time. So it's Taylor Small Batch was what usually, at, was like pretty findable around $40. Before. I mean, we didn't know what we were doing and we're reviewing it. So, yeah. I mean, that the, the bottles we started off with were some crazy ones. They were too. all crazy. Yeah. Elmer's? Hancock's. Yeah. This. We did do Clyde Mays. We had uh, Entrapment. Entrapment. Rhetoric's. <laughs> like, we had some good bottles. Oh, it's just channel on a boom, dude. Um, yeah. Okay, this is super sweet, like, hyper stereotypical Buffalo Trace, where it's like... It's got that red grape with, um, like, the apple skin note. Yeah. Just, like, bright fruit. Mm -hmm. It doesn't smell at all. Weirdly, now, though... It's a little fruit medley. All, all of a sudden, and I don't, I don't know, I don't think I'm supposed to get this, and I don't know why I am. I'm getting like a, you know when you walk into a nail salon? Like acetone? Really? Weirdly, just a little. It's like, like a hidden. sharpness? It's almost like hidden under the fruit, but I get it, and all I can think of is nail salon. I don't get that mm -hmm. at all. First whiskey of the day though. Parallel off my tongue. It's just good whiskey, huh? Yeah, it is. I mean, red apples, cherries, brown sugar, I think, that I don't realize I've gotten on that before. Like a little, little sweetness? Mm -hmm. Like a really nice, dark, warm sweetness. Not complex, super delicious. It's supposed to be 40 bucks. How would you pay for that now? You see one for 60, you don't have one, you buy it? For sure. You see one for 80, you don't have one, you buy it? I think that's Start a, to contemplate. Yeah. I'd Cause have it's to good, be, I don't think it's 80 good. Though. I'd have to be desperate. Now in current market, it's 80 good. Cause there's a lot of 80s that aren't this good in current market. Man, but remember when we I'm walked I'm with you on that, that brown sugar note. Isn't that interesting? I don't ever remember it. And I've never pulled brown sugar off anything other than like stag. Stuff it's like got that. like a, a little baby sweetness from front to back. Yeah. Hmm. It's really good. That's crushable whiskey though. Great. Cherry candy, like the hard cherry candies. Like um, the Jolly Rancher you're yeah, talking? Yeah. Something like that, like a cherry one. But it's like half cherry and then, or it's like three quarter to 80% cherry with just a little bit of grape stuck mm -hmm. on the end of it. Remember when we walked into that store in Kentucky? It was like the first time we ever went to Kentucky. We lost our minds because it was they $35 had, they had or something these like that. They case stacked for on sale. Yeah. And Michigan kid doesn't do liquor sales because we have state minimums here. But we walked into this weird liquor store in Kentucky and it was just like, oh, uh, it's Taylor, it's just cases on cases. And it was like, what in the world, dude? There's like a whisper of an, uh, the oakiness that's in Eagle Rare 10 okay. like on this, like just a sure. smidge on the finish. I'd nice 100 proof crusher. I'd imagine this is significantly younger than Eagle Rare. I would bet. Now, I'm not saying like on flavor, just based on that, you, we know that's 10. Maybe six. And this has to be four. So I would say it's probably a, you know, yeah. a blend, but six to four. Yeah. It's really good though. Yeah. And obviously everybody knows it's good, but I'm gonna stick with the red apple on er, everywhere on this. The cherries there, the brown sugar's only on the palate. That's my, I, do you think that we said any of these tasting notes in the first time we reviewed it. Apple. I, you think we said apple? I'm gonna say peaches or something stupid. In yours? Guaranteed. Sean said he'd never say peaches. Yep. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna start the video. You guys are gonna uh, watch it with us. You're gonna start watch us watch it with us. It's only six minutes though. And it's not very long and it'll be chopped up in inevitably anyway. So here we go. Welcome back to another Dan learns how to make cocktails and Sean gets mad at him for it. That's gonna happen. Uh, we're gonna talk to you about the sponsor of today's video, a little shaker and spoon. It's a really, really cool way that you can make some craft cocktails at home. So this month, what we did, we went in and signed up for the Japanese whiskey box because we've not done that. We've done some of the rye cocktails, the yeah. scotch cocktails, yeah. uh, the vodkas, all fantastic. We did a rum one. All you need to do is supply one bottle of the select alcohol, whatever you select that month, and then you can make 12 cocktails 
four of three different recipes. Nailed it. It's literally perfect. One bottle of alcohol, one box. Bunch of cocktails. It's, yep. it's exactly how you, in theory, you'd want it to work out for people like me. So, so let's make some cocktails. Dan is gonna be making the old KFC buck. I'm gonna be doing screw cap. Thai one on, which is one and a half ounce Japanese whiskey, one ounce Thai tea syrup, one and a half ounce coconut water, two dashes, not drops, orange bitters, three dashes, not drops, oh, curry good. cocktail spice. Okay, so I make mine in here. This is my shaker for all intents and purposes. We lost everything because- In we, the boating incident. Oh, I still got things to do. Was that scary for you? Yeah. It was scary for me too. This is literally the best cocktail ever because I can just make it without doing too much extra work. This is a strainer, top with soda. Put right in. Stir softly to combine. And then you need the top with your sesame seeds. We were really bad at the ice part of all of these. Mine was supposed to be in a Collins glass, but we don't own those. Look how, okay, I'm gonna be honest. Look at how much better mine turned out. Uh, mine looks better than yours. If we're being like garnish wise, mine's absolutely better than yours. That's because you have sesame seeds. All right, another fantastic set of cocktails from Shaker and Spoon. Thank you as always for working with the channel. If you guys are interested in checking them out, just go down right below, click the link, enjoy a little discount from us. Well, actually from them. Actually, we're just kind of doing it, you know. Sean's, that's the one of my favorite cocktails that we've that ever, I've had? ever had. It's the best Japanese uh, whiskey cocktail I've ever had in my life for real. And it's it's got to be close. this, whatever the, the Thai tea syrup is. It's it fantastic. tastes like those little um, airplane cookies, like the heightened. Biscottis. Yes, but better. It's freaking awesome. Yeah. Thanks Thank for uh, working with the channel, yes. as always. Uh, Check them out. Support the people supporting us. Cheers. Back to the video. Four years ago. Junkies. Oh, daddy. This is Colonel Taylor. Girl. This is the 14th. Yeah, you were. I look so mad at you. I was so strong. Make it through. I'm just afraid to drive home at this point in time. Oh, oh gee. This is the. Uh, I forgot about this. Oh, look at it. Look. Oh, oh, yeah. oh my gosh, I only had one tattoo on that arm. This is like. This is Mother. definitely still breaking the seal. Oh, 100%, buddy. Breaking the seal? What is that? Uh, the thunder text? This what is that? The whole episode. We used to use yeah, that for everything. Well, we broke yeah. the seal, so ignore that it's broken. Yeah. Um, and the camera overheated, oh. semi corrupted. You look like you lifted. SD I look like I the ate. camera. And here we are. So we're doing it again. You're getting this video probably tomorrow because it, uh, it's going to take no editing because we've done it so many times. Well, 24 technical yeah, issues, not one. So the camera over here. We used to have a Nikon overheated constantly. Gosh, dang it. Don't change that thing. Okay. I'm 99 Taylor. percent sure we Small just bat. have a spot. I think that uh, was the bottom, curtain yeah. with the frosted curtain. Three bulbs behind could it. Could be wrong on that. Give or take. It. Retails oh, around 40 bucks on her. Um, one of my favorite nah. original when I was starting to cut my teeth in <laughs> bourbon. One of my favorite bourbons. Um, what was your other? Rock Hill Farms. Have oh my gosh, it's so times. great. Because Rock Hill Farms is still one of wow, your favorites. Had that this is the third time. Uh, I remember buying a no, Colonel, yeah, yeah, the old E.H. Yeah. Taylor. He was very uh, influential. The old bought a, bought a distillery back in the day. What kind of hat right? box are we setting? Like, like if there's a stool yeah. with then, a hat uh, box was super sitting in the, uh, the whole 1897 we put bottle of Bon Act. Mm -hmm. Wow. He's why you have it. Well, Buffalo Trace is basically this is like okay. Old. I have chalk on the back of my shirt. So we just oh, we just got done lifting. Yeah. This is Buffalo Trace's like tribute to him, basically. He's Look like, how full that barter house is, too. I probably, yeah, that was probably the third one. Here's, a, here's all a fresh one. Fun fact! Shocker! Colonel Taylor is not a vampire. Exactly. He dead. <laughs> it's a cool we, bottle. Have we it's set a note yet? Bottle. You smelled it like I seven times. Well, I'm two minutes in. You can find Middle it for the, the 40 bucks. That's the thing. Colonel Taylor's becoming very Oh, okay. With the, the times you were a turn. hard to find. Okay. Times were a turn. We had like six of them. I... Was it two? At, like at least two seventy something. Yeah, least, yeah. Uh, yeah. buddy, you two eighty. Yeah, very sweet. Um, Apple, caramel. Oh, you don't say. Yeah, a little Tell bit. Me. Oh, maybe a little hmm? cinnamon. Oh, uh, I get less. Here's, less of here's that spice a lot. Wait for it. I didn't look like I lived. I get a lot more of the uh, nice smooth apple. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I get I get oak up front and get a little Yeesh. apple and a little sweetness. As you look finish. 45. Oh, you said apple. It goes into the finish. It'll that's it perfect. Off I'm great at this. Course, no. For me, it's flash in the pan, apple sweetness, up right up front. Interesting. Transition oak. to oak. oak. This time you said a whisper. Close there's, enough. There's nothing on the finish. Mm. 
I didn't like it much. Oh my gosh. gosh. Oh, the finish is still a pretty fun. We complained a lot. The, the, yeah, the nice did. thing is, like you just said, last month I got every bottle in there. You could drink copious amounts of this. And this, honestly, that's probably... And I would still enjoy it. Oh, I'm in a it. great and part. And I think that might oh, be I'm one of the so reasons it was, uh, the one of my OG picks. Yeah. Because um, it's yeah, it's it, not it's offensive. Yeah, it's, it's really good. Easy. Sweet. You, uh, you, get that sweet. Good you don't get a bunch of, like, it's not in-your-face rye no. flavors. Uh, it's not aggressive, and it's not that... Look at all the bookers now. we got. I think that this bottle will open up. We still probably have some of them. Everything we have is book. Buffalo Trays or bookers. We'll see. It smells like it'll open up. That's 100% just what it's lacking. A little bit of finish. <sighs> we never even got to this yet, so this is gonna be. Rumble, I bet you. Great! The one thing we haven't done tonight. I'm sure the camera will implode in three seconds. <laughs> C plus. Oh, I was gonna grade first. Oh, that is aggressively low. It feels like. You don't think so? Go ahead and explain yourself. So it's forty dollars. You're right. But if I wanted something a little bit more well-rounded, I think I'd reach to that sixty-dollar price range. There Ooh, are okay. a, a couple bottles on there. What if somebody told you 30 to 40? Uh, it'd probably push you to be minus no problem for me. No problem. I'll no. reach on the shelf and then drink this. It's a little rare right now. Yeah. So if you've seen the store for a retail, which we'll call 40, would you buy? We're it? trying to work yeah, on our grading scale I'll, I'll uh, in this video. It up to the B minus range for because me. Of the because of the rarity? the rarity. Okay. In my We're both opinion. really big fans of 1792 single barrel right now. We're mm -hmm. both kind of on the I am on that range. And the better. thing is, they really have and that. I wouldn't say my that. <laughs> I wouldn't say it actually, it profile. actually feels like it's this with a significantly Ooh, better more aspect. Yeah, yeah, nobody nobody watched it either. All right. Okay, I'm thinking about her. You know what? So I, that makes me feel better about it. I'm gonna go C plus. Here's C. the thing. Oh. Now here's the thing. Woo! I was gonna go. Nope. I was gonna go B minus. And then you were like, nope. Wait a I'm minute. I'm gonna tell you why I'm not going B minus. Because right. the only reason I was oh. going B minus, or not the only reason, but one of the main reasons, because I'm right. It, nope, is nostalgia. I was that okay. up. And I'm taking it out of it. And if if I don't think of this as man, when I was cutting teeth, which was a year was before this, probably. I mean, it's a big right, now, right to now. Tonight. Tonight. Tadite. Tadite. Not today or tonight, but tonight. Tadite. Let's see Okay. We were snobs, dude. We were huge snobs. C minus. This is fantastic. I enjoy it. I don't, there's there's no part of oh. it I dislike. I wish I had a But now that you said it, there's oh, no hard. time in life. My last four grades have been eight. I'm keeping this whole video up. No, oh, I'm not cutting the same. That I would buy it ahead of 1792. Single barrel. Single barrel. Specifically. Yeah. That's what I would compare it correctly to. And because 1792 is really sweet, mm -hmm. a little uh, bit I can't believe we're comparing the two. Not at all. And it's better than you. The finish is there. We didn't that, know. That's I get this solid I might right say, I don't, I'd have to grade this. At 40, it's probably like an A+. Plus. Plus. You just can't find it anymore. Well, I think even at 40, we didn't be plus do this four times. We're the Bourbon Junkies. I'm Dan. I'm Sean. And I'm going to take the memory card out for over here. I hope this No, no, no. I only had one here. In the intro, I only had one. You had pistols, though. Oh, yeah, yeah. In the intro, I only had one left for him. Whoa! I gave it a C minus. I think I gave it a B minus. And it wasn't even cold. Oh, like, if it wow. were cold, we would have given it like a D. I mean, I didn't have a full letter grade difference, but I've definitely come up a little bit. I'm a little harsh, but oh, we goodness. Were a snob. People call us snobs now. Yeah. That's snobbery. Apparently, we're just true to our roots. A C minus? <laughs> I mean, dude, a C minus on any E.H. Taylor product at this point is like crazy. The worst barrel proof I've ever had is better than that. Well, the good news is we are the same people. Dan's skinnier, Disaster. I'm skinnier. We have better cameras now. They don't overheat anymore. We're, yeah, we're definitely both in worse shape than we were then. 100%. I looked at myself today in the shower and said, you gotta get it together, man. I've been doing cardio so my heart doesn't explode because it feels like it's going to daily. Yeah, I need to start again. Yeah, it's interesting. I did for the, the step challenge and then like... <sighs> then stop stopped. because that was so long. Yeah. Okay, so needless to say, we said apple, you said some, you said oak. Oak, yep. I didn't hear another tasting note. We could have missed one. We probably did. We were really just picking ourselves apart, just talking over everything. Oh yeah, we're a disaster. We're, that's a disaster. The fact that that turned into anything is the wildest. I mean, it's like the Will Smith movie. And that's crazy. Ah. That's freaking crazy. Well, we're the Bourbon Junkies. Like, comment, subscribe. Check out Facebook group and Patreon if you want. We love you guys.
That was such Ew. how many reviews were shot like that? And at the beginning we're like, this is the 14th video that we fucking broke tonight.